This was a crime that brought to the fore Uttar Pradesh's increasing lawlessness and violence against women. A young woman raped and murdered, a body dumped in a schoolyard. And now the main suspect has been arrested and the police believe that they have cracked that case. However, the story he has put forward is quite different to the one that's being propagated by the police. मोबाइल मीना रेस भेलर से मिला था सर वहाँ वहाँ से किस तरीके से मारा था महिला को वह हाथ से मारे सर हाथ से मारे हैं This is Ram Sevak accused of attempting to rape and then murdering a 32 year old woman whose naked mutilated body was found inside a school compound in Mohanlal Ganj Lucknow It's been 4 days since with his arrest and subsequent confession the police claims the case has been solved but when asked the moot question, what motivated the victim to leave her house at night to meet one Rajiv, whose identity incidentally is still not known, this is what UP's top cop said. What motivated the woman to go in the night, right? I being a woman and seeing the dignity of a woman who has been brutally killed, hung on camera nahi bata payenge a subtle yet direct reference to the victim's character does not come as a big surprise considering its own failings at having floated multiple theories that either fell flat or were proven wrong usne ye bhi bataya tha ki after i realized ki uske haath mein mobile hai abhi uske baad wo leke usko pheka jhadi mein kal raat bhar khoji gayi hai jahan pe usne nishan de kari hai theek hai aur abhi bhi hum log koshish kar rahe hain find out karne ka explanations that even those within the uttar pradesh police department are not ready to buy i find particularly the theory of one individual doing everything whatever grotesque incidents actually took place to me it is completely unpalatable and unbelievable but the other fact is that today a sad aspect is that media pressure at times makes the police go hurriedly to an event fact is all that the police know today is from questioning the main accused ram sevak one man's account that fails to fill in the blanks like who is rajiv the person who the accused allegedly impersonated to meet the victim ghatna ek din pehle मम्मी ने मेरे से बोला था बेटा मैं पिजाई जा रही हूँ और उसके बाद फिर लौट के नहीं आए किसका फोन आया था उसके पहले राजीव का फोन आया था कौन है राजीव अब ये मैं नहीं जानती राजीव का नाम पता मैं कुछ नहीं जानती वॉज द मोबाइल फोन स्टोलन बाय दी अक्यूज राम सेवक फ्रॉम दिस राजीव उसकी सीबीआई जांच की हम मांग कर रहे हैं हमारे हमारे दोनों बच्चे अनाथ हैं इस पर विचार किया जाए हम संतुष्टि नहीं है हम सीबीआई जांच कराना चाहते हैं चाहे जो भी हो हमारे ही रिश्तेदार हों या लड़की वाले के रिश्तेदार हों जो भी हो उसको कड़ी से कड़ी सजा फांसी दी जाएगी एंड वाई हैज इन द पुलिस बिन एबल टू लोकेट द विक्टिम्स मोबाइल फोन फॉर द लास्ट सेवेंटी टू आवर्स डिस्पाइट द डिरेक्शन गिवन बाई दूज द पोलिटिकल हीट इज ऑन द अखिलेश गवर्नमेंट बट इन द प्रेशर टू डीम अ केस सोल्व द फैक्ट अपियर टू हैव टेकन अ बैक सीट इन दिस ग्रूसम मर्डर Bureau report headlines today